if you go to youtube and search for should i move to then these are the suggestions you are going to get which means many people are searching whether they should move to some abc xyz country now what is the reason people are searching this the reason is there is lot of data on, on internet there is lot of information on internet lot of articles blogs people's experiences which confuse you all together okay so you are not able to take a right decision right move or understand things in a clear way what would be important for you what would be right for you okay in this video i am going to discuss five pointers which will help you to take a better decision for yourself in this context and i am also going to tell you in the end if you want to move out right then how without anybody's help you can apply and you can get jobs outside of india for example let's say okay so where from this discussion is coming is i am i am seeing lot of articles on ppp ppp tells you that in usa if somebody is making 1.2 crores in an year in indian rupees then that is equal to 30 lakhs or 25 lakhs in indian rupees if you are working in india so that is kind of comparison of uh, how expensive india is and how expensive usa is and this is what is from the money point of view okay but i am going to talk less of money in this video and more of other things who am i to talk about all these things so i have stayed in seven different indian states for a significant amount of time and i have visited almost 40 countries till now and currently i am staying in the uk so i have seen different cultures and i have very closely observed what you learn when you work outside when you move outside when you travel and when you see a different culture different you know kind of people different kind of behaviors different kinds of traditions so what happens to you what happens to your personality let's discuss all these things guys okay first of all many of us now this is applicable to people uh, many of my juniors in colleges and many of people who whom i mentor right uh, they are very hesitant to move to a different part within the country itself which means if somebody is from northern part of india i see a hesitation in moving to southern part and vice versa okay this is where i tell to all my students and to whomever i mentor and i care about to whomever i love right i mean to all my students i love but i just say you know go out especially if you are not married you are single then what is there to worry about what is there to be scared about right just you know be out of your comfort zone so i am saying marriage in, in the context if you have a if you have a spouse who is working and if you have a small baby may be difficult to move but if you are single right you have to come out of your comfort zone okay applies to movement inside the country or moving outside of your country if you come out of your comfort zone right then you are going to be a better version of yourself i can guarantee you this okay but if you keep sitting in your comfort zone if you think that this is where i'll retire it is not going to help guys okay remember people will tell you income expenses etc but money is one very very important thing in life extremely extremely important life cannot run without money but there are more aspects to life and that is what I'm, what what is the theme of this video okay first is if you don't come out of your comfort zone you can't be a better version of yourself okay that is the first point second point is try to see different different cultures and different different traditions okay out of curiosity not out of a point of judgment point of view out of curiosity try to see why some culture is like this why people have this kind of eating habits in this part of geography why people have this kind of dressing in this kind of geography what is the reason for this okay without judging just out of curiosity try to understand why something is happening and you will slowly start developing a respect for different cultures different tradition different point of views different opinions different religions different belief systems so in spite of judging you should try to understand that particular part and then try to develop the personality of uh, you know uh, understanding the different systems that will make you a better person okay 
सो दिस इज कॉल्ड कल्चरल सेंसिटिविटी डेवलप दैट कल्चरल सेंसिटिविटी एंड इट विल बी इट विल बी इट विल गो लॉन्ग रन विथ यू दैट आई कैन गारंटी यू ओके थर्ड थिंग इफ यू मूव आउट ऑफ योर कंट्री लेट से इफ यू इफ यू मूव टू यू के और यू एस ए कैनेडा ऑस्ट्रेलिया वेर एवर वट विल हैपन इज यू विल स्टार्ट गेटिंग अ इंटरनेशनल नेटवर्क नाउ दिस दिस मे साउंड लाइक ए स्मॉल थिंग टू यू बट इट्स नॉट बिलीव मी इट्स नॉट गेटिंग अ इंटरनेशनल नेटवर्क राइट इज गोइंग टू हेल्प यू बिग टाइम इन लॉन्ग रन वेदर यू वॉन्ट टू डू ए स्टार्टअप वेदर यू वॉन्ट टू ग्रो professionally in your career which means you are looking for job opportunities you are looking to do something uh, for which there are no opportunities in your home country so something which is not heard of in this country for example all these things right if you if you have an people in different countries if you have a network in different countries that has its own value okay so remember the power of global network or international global network the next point i want to talk about here is professional development what is the meaning of professional development suppose you work in a team where all the people are of same same culture same tradition they talk kind of more or less same and they, their festivals are same their kind of belief system are same their way of talking way of reacting to a situation way of looking at things may be more or less same but if you are working with the people whose traditions are different whose cultures are different whose ways of you know eating habits are slightly different then what happens is you start getting uh, you start learning how to work with different set of people how to work with people from different different backgrounds how to work with people with different different you know behaviors or what are people's strength and weaknesses you have the uh, you have the topics to talk to people okay so for example if you Uh, if you talk to somebody in uk you will start talking about christmas you will start talking about what happens in christmas um, you know uh, this market is famous for christmas and these are the things you get in christmas so things like that right so you will have things to talk otherwise you will not have things to talk and having things to talk means you will be able to create that rapport that relationship that trust and slowly slowly that will help in your managing your team managing your clients managing your bosses managing your network managing your juniors right so in all these aspects it will help you in your professional growth okay and last but not the least guys in the beginning i told you right money is just very very important very very important but one part of the story the other part of the story is traveling and seeing the world right so if you are getting an opportunity to travel and see the world and if you can afford that right i don't think anybody can give you more experience and more fun than that okay so in the end of this video i'll be just dropping some of the some of the trips that i went and you know i i just want you to see I, i don't want to show off like i went to these these places now i also want to tell you here uh if you want to apply for somewhere outside so maybe uk usa canada australia gulf countries middle east um, dubai any anywhere you want to apply right so you have to do two things guys remember first is uh, you know first choose your target country for example let's say i want to apply for dubai what i will do is i will go and create a linkedin network of people working in dubai in data science so i will start you know sending request and that is phase 1 okay create a larger network of people working over there that is your phase 1 once you have a good amount of network you can start reaching out to people for refer uh, referring you and go to the company's portal and start applying directly so for example if i have to apply in general electric ge i will go to ge portal and i will just apply in their career section okay if i have a connection who can refer me i will tell to the connection please refer otherwise i am good i mean uh, from the career portal i am good so this way if if i'm clear on uh, where i have to go then i can start doing my things so the the crux of this video is guys people may talk about income expenses ppp etc that is very important extremely crucial but there are more aspects of why you should go to a new place work in a new culture you know network with the people who are different from you and you know 
just just for that experience for that learning for your personal growth for networking and obviously for travel okay let me know how did you like this video guys and see you all in the next video wherever you are stay safe and take care